Hello and welcome to the 11 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa arrived today in the city of Alexandria, Egypt, to attend the opening of the Mohammed Najib military base and a ceremony for graduating cadets. The graduating cadets are from Egypt and a number of GCC countries, including Bahrain. Upon arrival, His Royal Highness the Crown Prince was received by a number of senior Egyptian officials, as well as the Ambassador of Bahrain to Egypt, Sheikh Rashid bin Abdurrahman Al Khalifa. His Royal Highness the Crown Prince said that he was delighted to visit Egypt, highlighting Egypt's rich cultural heritage and its strategic role in supporting Arab issues. His Royal Highness recognized Egypt's long standing and distinguished role in developing its defense forces and military capabilities and added that the opening of the Mohammed Najib base represents another milestone in Egypt's military achievements. He also spoke of the strong bilateral relations that exist between Bahrain and Egypt and stressed that this has facilitated coordination and collaboration across many areas. He went on to add that efforts to strengthen bilateral ties are vital to achieving shared goals of security and stability in the region, including combating terrorism and its funding. His Royal Highness the Grand Prince extended the best wishes of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa to President Abdel Fattah al Sisi and all the people of Egypt. The Kingdom of Bahrain lauds the success of the security forces of the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, which led to the elimination of three wanted terrorists who had perpetrated a number of terrorist acts and crimes in Qatif province. The Kingdom affirmed that its support to the Brotherly Kingdom of Saudi Arabia in its war against all terrorist groups and its total rejection of whatever might undermine Saudi security and stability. The Kingdom of Bahrain highly values the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia's pivotal role in combating terrorism at both regional and global levels and draining its funds, as well as it hails its incessant efforts to underpin security and peace regionally and internationally. Meantime. The Kingdom of Bahrain renews its unwavering stance that rejects terrorism and calls for concerted international efforts to uproot this menace which seeks chaos and instability and puts the world's security at stake. The Saudi Interior Ministry announced today that three wanted men were killed in clashes with security forces in Qatif. The wanted men were spotted in a stolen vehicle and opened fire on security forces. The ministry said that the men were involved in terrorist operations, including the killing of security men. The three terrorists were spotted at Az Zuhur district, Sehat city in Qatif, where explosives and weapons were also found. A video of the Saudi ministry report announced the names of the killed terrorists who drove a stolen car that, hid that had a fake number plates.